Today's topic is how to maintain a good vaginal hygiene. Well, do we need all these intimate washes that are now available in the markets? Let us discuss this. So, first point is that vagina is a self-cleansing organ. That means it does not require anything from outside to take care of its cleanliness. There are certain bacteria called lactobacilli in vagina, which is the normal flora and fauna of vagina. These bacteria, they make lactic acid, which basically makes the environment acidic. The pH of vagina is around 3.8 to 4.5, which is towards the acidic side. This acidity prevents infection from other bacteria as well as other fungal infections. So as such, if we are just cleaning vagina once a day with simple water, that is more than sufficient. It does not require any of these intimate washes which are now being marketed all over. These intimate washes, they may cause rather allergic reactions or in long term, they may promote various infections later on in life. So, my advice would be to avoid any of these washes. Just use plain water and a mild soap is more than sufficient. Avoid soaps with chemicals, avoid any perfumes, avoid any deodorants down there. We do not need any fragrance related products down there. Hence, nothing of these V washes, nothing at all is required. Secondly, Vaginal douching is also not required. Vaginal douching is putting some water inside, which may rather have a reverse effect and it may increase infection. So, no vaginal douching is required. Just cleaning once a day with simple water and mild soap is more than sufficient. Then how other, other ways are how to take care of the genital hair? Well, there are many ways but there are pros and cons to each method. First is waxing. Many people go for waxing in that area, but that may increase a lot of infections, especially if it is not done at a hygienic place. Second is shaving. Shaving may cause a lot of irritation, a lot of folliculitis or hair infection next day or next to next day, which causes a lot of itching to the clients. Hence, Shaving is also not recommended. The methods I recommend is either you go for a complete laser hair removal, which may require six to eight sittings, but then obviously it's a costly procedure. The other way is trimming or using a trimmer. So trimmer takes care of the hair, but it doesn't clean it from the surface and hence prevents the infection. The most important method to keep vaginal hygiene is to promote sexual hygiene. The most common cause of vaginal infection is because of any sexual activity. So protect yourself from any unprotected sex. Always use condom. Maintain a good hygiene post-sex. Immediately wash yourself down there. Pee down there. Overall, maintaining a good sexual hygiene will give you a good vaginal hygiene. Thank you so much.